You might be surprised by how easy it is to make crepes at home. Here's a basic recipe you can try for yourself. Start by sifting pastry flour into a large bowl. Sifting the flour helps to get rid of lumps in the batter so your crepes come out beautifully smooth. Next, add one tablespoon of sugar and a quarter teaspoon of salt to the flour and whisk to combine. Now it's time to add the wet ingredients, starting with milk. We used whole milk, but pretty much any kind of milk will work, followed by two whole eggs. Give the batter a really good whisk. This isn't like pancake batter where you want to leave lumps. For the ideal crepe batter, you need it super, super smooth. So to ensure there are absolutely no lumps, strain the batter through a sieve and use a spatula to push it through. Now you're ready to start cooking. Melt some butter in a non-stick or cast iron pan over medium heat. Use a ladle to scoop a portion of the batter into the pan, then gently swirl the pan so the batter spreads out evenly across the surface. Cook for about one minute, then use a spatula to gently flip the crepe and cook for about another minute on the other side. This recipe will make roughly 8 to 10 crepes of this size. You're now ready to add any filling you like. We stuck with the classic Nutella, but fruit or jam would be amazing as well. Fold the crepe into quarters and you're ready to serve. Subscribe to Dished for more basic recipes.